Deontay, how important is it to fight in the States? Next That's question. That's a good... Uh, is it? Yeah. Fighting in the States, is that an advantage for you against Tyson Fury? Not at all. I think everywhere is my home. You know, I travel anywhere in the world to fight where it's safe for fans to come, my family, and anybody that enjoy boxing to come and, and be in a safe environment. Deontay Wilder will go there. Throughout my career, I've been to so many different countries and for. That's why I'm the most experienced, like I'm the, in the heavyweight division, I'm the most experienced guy in the heavyweight division. I'm the, most, I'm the longest reigning champion in the sport, period, but I'm the most experienced guy in the heavyweight division. Not only I'm for almost every style, not only I'm undefeated with all, with all knockouts, but, you know, I, it's, nothing, it's nothing in this sport with dealing with these fights, even, even with their personality and stuff, like I haven't seen. It's nothing I haven't, I don't feel I've endured to haven't seen. It, it's just like with Fury, he got an awkward style, he's tall, I've never seen that before, but I've seen the styles, I've seen the guy that um, try to prepare their mind to, to psych themselves out to thinking that they, they can got an edge. He's looking for responses from me, and he ain't getting what he want. He's looking for me to, you know, a little push and all that. That ain't, that ain't, that ain't fading, man. Yeah. People get, people get timid. People want to jump because it's me and Fury. It's heavyweights, and they know, they know. With me, you know, you just, I'm unpredictable. I'm, I'm, I know I'm unpredictable, I, you know. But I'm also smart as well too. You know, fighting outside, you know. And fighting outside of, 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 of December is not going to do nothing. It's just like when I went to Belfast, the situation. There's so many things that could have happened in the Nando situation that I could have. Crazy. But why? For what? For a less of a guy that I'm going to make multi-million, you know, with another guy. Why? Make that bad decision. I've learned. It was one point in time in my life I was facing 26 years when I when I was finna get ready to fight for a title. You know, that was during the time where I had to, when me and uh, Derek Chisora was lying to fight and I couldn't travel the country. I couldn't even leave my country because of one mistake, because of one thing that I was innocent for. But I had to go through the process. But we here now, I can't wait, baby. Y'all should be excited about it, I'm here. I'm, over, I'm loving every time I come over here. You guys show me so much love and hospitality. Man, it's crazy. You know, you have really thought, may have me think about getting, getting, getting a flat or apartment over here. You know what I mean? And you know, in the future, it's going to be definitely bright. I want to expand my, my love. I want to expand my, 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 my brand. I want to expand me all over the world. My title says the heavyweight champion of the world. So with that being said, I want to travel the world. I can't wait to come over here and fight again. I can't wait. We just waiting on the appropriate time. That's that's nothing. That's never uh, not an option for us. We don't care about where it is. Just let it be right. Let's make it right. Get the fans what they want to see. And that's what I'm about. I want to give you guys what you want to see. I know sometimes I have to fight mandatories and have to jump around and do this and that. But believe me, when Deontay says something, it's just like I told Dylan White, you fight Luis Ortiz, I promise you, you have Deontay Wilder. When have I not been a man of my word? My people are for me. Whoever guy I want, they go go get it. They go get it for me. At least they try, like we said, they try. So, you know, White always told me, if he really wanted me, he could have been had me too. Not to get on him, just he know what to do. I, I'm willing to go anywhere, you know? I think Fury was finished. That's it, guys. That's it. That's it. That's we it. Gotta we gotta go. Gotta catch a flight, nah, Fury ain't finished. Yeah, I brought Fury back. Yeah. Did you meet you? I motivated him to come back. I brought. I'm the one brought him back. Come back, you bum. <laughs> <laughs> you ain't you, you 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 know because I feel like I did feel like when he fought Klitschko, that was his biggest. Yeah, um, I think he he accomplished a goal, a big goal that he always wanted. I think he rekindled the love of boxing and brought it back because that was the ultimate, it's just like my ultimate goal is to unify, okay, you know? And his was to beat the Klitschko and he did that. And now he got fat, he did his thing. I had to come back and yo, come on, you dog, sir. <laughs> but I love you guys, thank you so much. December the 1st, don't miss it. If you can't make it, click it.